gotta believe, oh gotta believe, gotta believe I'm gonna make it one more round. I gotta believe in myself. You gotta believe in yourself. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new here. My name is Bethany. I am a stay-at-home mama to two wonderful babies under two and here on my channel you find lots of cleaning motivation as well as lifestyle videos and an occasional mobile home update and if you're new here hello and welcome i'm so happy to have you here if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for clicking on today's video today we're going to be starting in my bedroom i'm going to make my bed for the day just to get that out of the way and then we are going to tackle the rest of the house today's video is an all day clean with me i have been cleaning all day and I figured I would start in the bedroom today just so that way it gives me the motivation to tackle the rest of the home. But I hope that you guys will enjoy and consider giving this video a thumbs up if you like it. Can't breathe, I'm almost dead. Of time, I'm so ahead. Dark bullets can bite my fears and dry my tears and hope for a winner. I'm running free. Oh, I am free. So after I made my bed this morning, I wanted to move on into the kitchen. I had made some muffins this morning with my daughter, so the counters needed a good wiping, and I had dishes in the dishwasher that needed to be put away, as well as a few dishes in the sink washed, but it wasn't too bad on this day. So I'm gonna go ahead and get to tackling this, so that way we can focus on the living room. I'm also going to be cleaning the kids' rooms in this video as well. There was just a lot of spaces that needed a little bit of love today, so we are tackling that. I hope that this video will give you lots of motivation to tackle a space in your home or to clean along with me. Told me that's what you needed. That's in my face. Yeah. Cause you were kind of one and once I was done cleaning the counters and wiping down the stove and dishwasher and the cabinets down there, I wanted to go ahead and sweep the floors as well as mop. I like to do this at least a couple times a week as far as the mopping goes. The sweeping or vacuuming with my stick vacuum happens just about every day just because I do have a 9 month old and he does crawl all over the floors so I don't want him to put anything in his mouth so I do try to keep the debris off the floor as much as I can but I like to mop at least twice a week if not more when needed but I'm gonna go ahead and get that done today as well as take the trash out we had a full trash can and it really just needed to go out so I'm gonna go ahead and get that done as well and put a new bag in that so that way the kitchen is fresh and clean we are starting with a clean slate for the evening So I just wanted to show you before we got a new coffee maker recently and we ended up getting the white one but it definitely shows all of the coffee marks. I'm going to go ahead and wipe this down as well as the bar that this sits on. This is a place that nothing really sits up here except for the coffee maker and the computer and a plant so it gets dusty and it just needed a good wipe down today. 
Feeling something, cause late last night you were feeling nothing. How could you be over me in a week when I'm still feeling so lonely? Found my sweater that you took all the time, still smells like you like when you were mine. How could it be that I see memories in between all these worn ass scenes? Cause you're seeing someone else, and I heard he treats you. So now the kitchen is all clean. I had wiped down the kitchen table as well as the bar behind that, all of the lower cabinets and the dishwasher and stove and it just feels so good. There's something about having a clean kitchen for the day that just makes me so happy as well as a made bed. So I'm just so glad that I was able to get all of this done today. I would love to hear what you guys are doing while you're watching this video and I hope that you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. These vacant sheets don't feel like home And I cry every night when I reach by my side Cause you're not there and I forget That you're seeing someone else so now I'm going to move on into the living room. We just had a few toys on the floor here, so I'm just giving you an overview of that. But I'm going to get all of these picked up and organized just a little bit better on the shelf. I am eventually going to get a cubicle shelf and move a lot of these toys to the kids' rooms. But I am just going to go ahead and get all of this done today. I also am going to wipe down my son's jumpy and the shoe box. I will show you a before of both of those here in just a moment. But I'm going to wipe those down too because they don't definitely needed it. My son's jumpy had a few crumbs on it from snacks he had and somehow some way the shoe box always gets dirt and dust and grime on it so I'm going to go ahead and wipe that down as well. I hope that you guys are getting lots of motivation from today's video. So here is that before of the shoe box. I am trying my best to show you guys and point out where the dirt and grime and just spills are on it. So I just wanted to show that to you guys, but if you hear my son chatting in the background or playing with a rattle, he's up from his nap now and that is just normal mom life around here. got the shoe box and the jumpy wiped down and all the toys picked up the lighting the living room the lighting 
Oh goodness guys, the living room looks so much better now and it's so much more tidy, it just makes me happy. It is a wonderful day here, it's very sunny but we have some crisp fall-like feeling air and it just feels so good so I have the windows open with window fans going just to let the house breathe but it was a great day to get the house nice and clean. Do you guys like to clean on cool fall days or do you guys like to snuggle up and watch a movie or something? I would love to hear. But now I'm going to move on into my son's room. This needed to be picked up. His bed needed to be made. I also needed to go through his dresser and get rid of a bunch of clothes that don't fit him. His birthday and my daughter's birthday is coming up here and I know they're going to get clothes for their birthday so I just wanted to go ahead and get this decluttered and get rid of a whole bunch of stuff so that way we can make room for anything new they may get. Now that his dresser is all decluttered, I have a pile of garbage on the top and then in this bin here that is all donation of stuff that doesn't fit him anymore but the top drawer of his dresser has his bibs and his swimsuit and then all of his socks and the second drawer in his dresser is going to be all of his onesie pajamas and two piece pajamas as well as the onesie t-shirts. The third drawer down in his dresser is all of his outfits, things like pants and regular shirts, and then the bottom drawer is extra diapers and clothes that he doesn't quite fit in yet. But now that that's done, I'm going to go ahead and just clean up all the toys in his room and vacuum in here and make his bed, and it just ends up feeling so much better in here. This is a task I've needed to get done for quite some time, but I'm just pawning off going through their clothes. And I have a big basket of donation that's going to go to Goodwill as well as some other things. His room just feels so much better. And where these toys are over here, we have a few things to get rid of like the bouncy. But I'm going to go ahead and get a cubicle shelf for somewhere in his room. That way we can better organize the toys. And I think it will hold them a lot better as well. So it's just much cleaner in here and it feels so good to get this task done. Now that my son's room is clean, I'm going to go ahead and move on into my daughter's. They were playing in here earlier on this day and there were some toys on the floor, so I'm going to go ahead and get to picking up all of this. But if you notice a shirt change, that's because it's mom life over here and accidents happen. So I had to change my shirt, so that's, that's what's up with the random part of that. But I'm going to just go ahead and get all these toys cleaned up, get her room vacuumed and her bed made as well.
trust my intuition and my intuition tells me something to stay right you've been deflecting all the simplest of questions and that and now her room is all nice and clean i really can't wait for her birthday till she can get a little kitchenette over there in the corner where all those toys are and we can get a cubicle for my son's room to organize all the toys that are in here and in his room better but they both turned out nice and clean and just a lot better than they were before but i do want to thank you all for watching today's video i hope that you will consider joining my youtube family and giving this video a thumbs up if you liked it i hope you all have a wonderful and blessed day and i'll see you in my next one bye y'all